נכנסו לחדר. יעברו, תעברו, תעברו. And I want to make clear, we are not looking for a confrontation in our northern border or with uh, anyone else. We are focused on destroying Hamas infrastructure and bringing our citizens back home. But if Hezbollah will drag us into war, it, is, it should be clear that Lebanon will pay the price. Lebanon cannot be... A, a sovereign member of the international community, its citizens carrying a Lebanese passport, but when it comes to attacking Israel, they're not responsible. Between an Israeli citizen or anyone who holds another... Like you, we're extremely uh, worried and disturbed as to the immense rise of anti-Semitism around the world, also in your country. We um, care for our brothers and sisters, Jewish communities all over the world for their well-being and safety and I think the international community must take strong actions to protect the, uh, the Jewish citizens all over the world. Thank you for coming to Israel and sharing your support with us. The first objective we should have today is the release of all the stages without any distinction because this is an awful crime to play with these lives of children, adults, all people, civilians and soldiers. But I want, I want you to be sure that you are not left alone in this war against terrorism. Because I speak here on behalf of a country which experienced these terrorist attacks unhappily. And you were there at the time. And I think this is our duty to fight against these terrorist groups. Without any confusion, without, I would say, enlarging this conflict, what happened will never be forgotten, for sure. Thank you. And we will be here today, tomorrow, and the day after, for peace and stability, because these people were killed just, be just because they were Jewish, and they wanted to live in peace. Mm -hmm. Thank you.